Hey Crown Gang, welcome back to my channel and as you read in the title, I will be sharing with you guys all of my empties that I have so far. So the way that I'm going to do this video, you guys, is I'm going to put them in either a to buy again pile or a not to buy again pile. I'm also going to share my experiences using these products. Before we get into all that, if you're not already subscribed, go ahead and stop this video now. Hit that subscribe button right down below and yeah, let's go ahead and get into our first product. If you're OG subby of mine, y'all already know the main choices on here. And I'm going to be kicking it off with their restorative refresher spray. I love this stuff, you guys. I use this on my hair maybe every other day. And it really does bring my curls back to life. It gives it a light hold. It like tames my frizz if I have frizz here and there. And the smell is really good. It's like a perfumey smell. When I say that, it's not in a bad way. It's like if somebody else was using it on their hair and they walked by me and I like got a whiff of their hair and it's just like, I can tell like, hey, you use the main choice spray. You know, it's really, it's a good smell. So yeah, I will definitely be purchase, purchasing this one again. My hair loves it. Next product, you guys, I have seen lots of naturals raving about this and I still was just like, eh, don't want to try it. And it's from K2, it's their leave-in conditioner. I know y'all like, what in the world is that? It is their sample size. I got this from the Natural Hair Show. And honestly, I'm a skeptic when it comes to everything. And I'm just not the type of person to jump on the bandwagon when other people like stuff. Because I have been that person before. And I'm always that one person that the product don't work for. And honestly, I was kind of thinking that this was going to be the same thing. But honestly, it, it works beautifully with my hair. Now, I normally use regular conditioner as my leave-in, and it's been working for years for me. But I can honestly say I can see me using this more than the regular conditioner, like during the hotter months, which it is hot now. Um, I say that because this one is light, and it feels like it's actually designed to be a leave-in conditioner. Like, even though I use regular, regular conditioner in my hair, it's not designed to do that, so it's a bit heavier. So of course in the hotter months, I don't want my hair heavy being weighed down with nothing. So this one is definitely a better option and I'm sold. So I'm definitely going to put this in the buy aisle and I'm going to go run and get me some ASAP. Next you guys is also from the main choice. It is their deep conditioner. This stuff is so good. I love it. I believe I talked about this product before. It's, if you have this in your cabinet. Use it on dry hair, like use this on your hair while it's completely dry. Thank me later, okay? This product is the truth. It's like my curls, they look really nice, but then after I'm finished using it, it's like, yeah, it was it feels like you know, my hair was really missing something and I didn't really know until after I used this. So even though I do love this product, you guys, I've complained about this before the price. It's eight ounces for $18. And for me, I'm just like, it's a good product, but there's other deep conditioners out there that work just as well. So I'm not going to put it in a not to buy again. I'm going to say I'm going to have to catch this one on sale. So catch it on sale pile. The next product, you guys, is from Swap Professionals. And I know y'all have never seen this on my channel, but it is their Keratin Infused Conditioner. I've been using it for a couple of months now and yeah honestly I haven't really liked it. That's why I've never featured it on anything, any of my videos. And what made me want to try it was the keratin. A lot of people rave about keratin and my protein treatment that I use, my Afigy protein treatment is keratin. And I love that stuff. So naturally I thought okay my hair is going to love the conditioner too right? Wrong. As I stated before I leave my regular conditioners in my hair. I left this in my hair and it just, it were, it made, it, it was a mess you guys, like my hair frizzed out and it made me really nervous to put anything else in my hair, like I layer my hair with oils and gels so it's just like okay, maybe if I put gel on it, it will like make it better and it didn't so it's like damn, like this conditioner right here, mm mm. Now, why is it empty? Because I did use it, y'all. Like, I paid money for it. I'm going to use it. So, the best way that I have used it was as a detangler. And I made sure, after I was finished detangling my hair with it, I washed it completely 
out of my hair. I didn't want any traces of this in my hair after I'm done using it because it just caused a lot of havoc in in my hair and I'm just not here for it. So for that, I will not be behind this again. Like it's affordable, yeah, but for what it did to my hair, no, to not buy. The next product, you guys, you also have never seen on my channel before, but it's Herbal Essence Light Gel Spray. And I have put the name light in it because it's a light gel. And I've been down with this product for about a year now. And I really like it. I found it in my mother-in-law's bathroom and I was kind of like using it behind her back. If y'all got a natural in the house, don't leave your hair products around the bathroom because I'm going to find it and I'm going to use it. So I asked her where she got it and she said she purchased it from Walmart and that she really didn't like it and I could have it and I'm like, oh really? Like, you ain't got to tell me but once. Like, you can't have it back. So yeah, I've been using it ever since then and my hair loves it. It is a light gel, you guys. Don't use it and expect to get that Eco Styler hold because yeah, it's a very light hold. But it's really good at taming my frizz and it's really good like for first day curls. I like to use it on my hair while it's still wet. Sometimes you just have those flyaways that, you know, nothing really works. But I've noticed this has worked with those flyaways. So this is definitely going in to buy again pile. My last product that I'm going to talk about, you guys, is from Shea Moistures. It is their Curl Enhancing Smoothie. A lot of naturals use this. I have been using this one for four years. Shea Moisture, this is the first product that I've actually purchased for my natural hair. And I use it on my hair, I love it. Um, I use it on my little one's hair, and I swear I've caught my husband using this before too. But yes, I'm saying all that to say, unfortunately, it is time to retire this product, you guys. It is going in the not to buy again pile, and I'm gonna explain why. The moisture has been under a lot of the topic of conversation in the natural hair community before that terrible ad. Like, I'm not gonna sugarcoat it, it was terrible. And I'm not going to sit here and say that that didn't influence my decision. It had a little part of it. But I've also noticed like in recent years they've changed like their prices. Their prices went up and it's like when I first started buying Shea Moistures everything pretty much was $9.99 you know. But recently like you can go and you can find stuff that's $13.99 and up and it's like okay you're upping your prices. Has the formula changed? Like, are you using higher quality ingredients? Like, no, everything's the same. Like, okay, am I getting more product? Like, why is the price all of a sudden jacked up? And it's the same size, so it's like, okay, you know, it's not four years ago. I, there's more natural hair products out there for me that work just as well, if not even better, than the Curl Enhancing Smoothie in. The ad really, like, it really did it for me, and I was just like, yeah, I'm just not going to buy it again. So, yeah, I'm definitely retiring the Curl Enhancing Smoothie now. So, you guys, this is every, all of my product empties as of now. As y'all can see, I have a lot of products that, you know, are going to be empty eventually. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share and subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. I'm gonna go get some more.